Lord saying that the fear of the Lord is about to be revealed in America. God is going to terrify. God is about to terrify America. California will be terrified for the act that was performed in San Francisco when they marched down the streets and they mocked the Son of God. When they made a public spectacle of the darling of heaven in San Francisco the Lord says he is about to terrify California he is about to terrify New York I see explosions after explosions after explosions in New York and the Lord says the evil that they intended for the rest of the nation will now fall upon them themselves. The architects of this evil, the planners, the people that schemed, the people that brought forth this agenda, the people that created this diabolical agenda, the evil that they intended for the rest of the nation will not come upon the rest of the nation, but will come upon them. For they dug this hole. They made this bed and I'll make them sleep on it. I will terrify those that have forsaken me. I will shake and cause to tremble from coast to coast. Those that have chosen to deny my precepts and embrace their own carnality. Those that have defied my decreed, my decreed word, that are the spoken words that I've spoken through my prophets in this nation for years. I will now begin to terrify this nation. But my children, do not be afraid. For you'll be shielded, you'll be protected. For I have sanctioned my angels to watch over those that belong to me. And just like in the days of Sodom and Gomorrah, there were angels that directed my people to flee. So will I do the same in this season. As you see the judgment fall, it will not touch you. For I must purge and remove the evil that has entered in the midst of this nation. Even from the highest of the offices, I am about to terrify men. I'm about to terrify the greatest of men with the diseases and heart attacks and afflictions and accidents and misfortunes until they repent and return to me. I will terrify this nation that it might run back to me, that it might run back to me in repentance, in surrender, in brokenness. I'm calling America for repentance. I'm calling this nation from the north, south, east, and west to repent and return to me. All the pulpits of America, all the pulpits of America must embrace repentance in this season. Failure to do so, I'll continue to expose and to shut down every pulpit that will not honor me. But the pulpit is not a place to glorify men. It's not a place to glorify their callings and their giftings, that the glories that they have deprived me, the honors for which they have deprived me, and therefore I will deprive them of the same glory. And I'll purge the church from the dross of sin. And I'll continue to purge the pulpits across America until there's a sincere and a genuine repentance. I have began to clean America. 
And if it begins in the house of the Lord, what will become of the world? Says the Lord. Says the Lord. Says the Lord. 